we sought an individual who lives the liberal arts, who will embrace our paths of progress and help us build an even more inclusive and engaged community. A leader who will inspire others, a leader who will take us from what is now to what is next. This individual is Dr. Barbara K. Altman, our 16th president, a highly recognized teacher, scholar, and passionate leader. Thank you so much. What an extraordinary reception. Thank you so much. The chance to join you and to become a diplomat, this is going to be the biggest adventure of my professional life. FNM has been on a rising trajectory for a decade and a half, thanks to really outstanding leadership. I am humbled to join you as president, and whose job is really to continue the trajectory and then to push forward into the next chapter. It was immediately clear to me that not only are your students absolutely superlative, they are so strong, but your faculty is sterling. I'm thrilled that FNM has our first woman president. I'm, I'm as a, uh, an English professor, I'm thrilled that we have a humanist, that she brought an amazing humanities center to Bucknell. This is just nothing short of an, an historic day in our college's history. There has never been a president with the qualifications that Barbara brings to this role you're going to have the chance to both grow as an educator and to really enjoy collaborating with this group while taking us to places that perhaps we can't yet imagine, but that you will help us to see. I was really excited to meet her, and I really liked her point about the faculty at FNM being a really strength, a really good strength here because the faculty is incredible. Just getting to talk to her, you just get this welcoming vibe. I look forward to meeting every one of you, whether it's on the football field, in the cafeteria, in the classroom, in the dance studio. We'll have lots of places to explore together. Thank you all for coming. This has been an extraordinary welcome. Thank you. This is the medallion that accompanies the presidency of Franklin and Marshall College. And I've had the honor of wearing this at uh, seven convocations and eight commencements. And now you will have that honor and I'd like to present that to you. Oh, it's